my beautiful Aquarius, welcome to my channel. This is your feed with Fortune Teller Divine Light and today I'm going to do a coffee cup reading for your overall energies and at the end I'm going to pull some cards to get more clarity. Also I'm going to add a link up here if you would like a private reading from me you can just go ahead and click that link up there and uh, also only 30% of you haven't subscribed so if you're enjoying these videos don't forget to subscribe to the channel. It helps the uh, channel to grow also gets this message to the ones who really need to hear it as well okay. It's free. You can unsubscribe anytime you want. Let's dive into your reading. I see there's an outside line forming here, phone line forming for you, and there's an international path or maybe an outside opportunity, unexpected opportunity showing here for you. On the bottom of your heart, I see like a, some sort of um, tide happening within you, which is a good thing. I see a crescent moon actually forming here so this can be an idea coming to your mind maybe you want to travel somewhere or you want to go move somewhere and that can be the tide that can be the feeling of change coming through the crescent moon indicates that um that's for your if that's for your highest good the legal part of it will be actually taken care of really smoothly i see here there's a person standing and that reminds me of kind of like hierophant energy because he's wearing skirt um the hierophant is actually represented by Taurus and can be like a, the character you see looks like the Pope, the, the power, the, the authority character, uh, the powerful character that's sitting on the throne. Uh, so this can be you actually, because I'm seeing you, you are in a higher position than this uh, powerful character. So this can be someone that you have been dealing with in the past, maybe because of their authority, um, they actually dragged you a little bit. But now I see that you are actually rising above them. And I see a duck on your chest. So you are looking at them with an understanding rather than being hateful. You're looking at them with an understanding. You're understanding their position. Instead of getting revenge, I feel like you're going to be moving on to another level. And when you do, there's a legal paper right there. I see here a baby horse forming. This looks like a little like caricature. So this can be something fun that you're desiring to have. Uh, will be coming through because horses means wish fulfillment. And also, I see after this break that you're going to have, I see someone angry here. So you getting some accomplishment might actually just um, topple some people's worlds. But um, you're not really going to, you know, dwell on that. You're moving on really fast. I see there's a cup here. There's a person lifting you up inside the cup, holding their legs and just pushing you up. Cup means emotional fulfillment, a new beginning. Can be romantic. Uh, because somebody's lifting you up here, but also can be uh, an endeavor that you're going to be stepping into. It may be a new job environment, new opportunity that will actually make you feel loved. That that's going to make you feel um, this true love within yourself. And when you feel keep feeling that energy, this is actually going to tell me that, that you're going to be raised um, above everything and everyone else really faster. I see here. There's an eye. There is a little girl above it with a skirt. This can also be, looks like a little um, hut here, like a little house. And somebody's inside of it. You can see somebody's inside of it. And another one is standing up, uh, above it. So if you're planning to change your place, buy a new house, maybe like find a place for yourself and maybe even a, renting out a room that is a private for yourself. Um, be careful with the landlords and the people that you're hiring it from, like buying it from or maybe renting it from because they might actually want to have a strict control over all the things or you might be already experiencing that and i see like in your face the frustration and you're actually going to be getting out i see there's somebody here they're holding up like this gecko maybe they're trying to block you to get out um this can be because i see male figure so this can be a loving father or someone who thinks that you're not going to be safe out there. Uh, if that's the case, um, it's good to just, you know, address everybody's fears and then move on from there. But I feel like when you address everything, you're actually going to be uh, getting a lot of support from these people. There's another cup right here and this cup is full. This can be your cup already being full as well. So um, like being a full, getting fulfillment from the second option you have. I saw here immediately, there's like two people here. Initially, I saw them like when I pull it away cheek to cheek. They are still cheek to cheek, but they're not hugging. This can be siblings that if you're planning to do start something new, maybe you might get a sibling or someone very close to you to walk that path with you, okay? 
Let's get into your plate now. If you have a question, a desire, an intention, hold it in your mind. Let's see what the answer is going to be. This looks like a halo you're being surrounded by. So if the things, uh, there's a person here lecturing, like you have the hierophant in the beginning as well. You might have a couple people just trying to teach you something. Your desire coming really fast, by the way. Or maybe try to change your mind about some, certain things. But uh, they are doing this out of their own con conditioning. It's not because of the knowledge that they have. Because something that you're desiring can be the thing that never has anybody ever experienced or accomplished before. But they might have this, um, you might have like this overly protective people surrounding you. And maybe that is actually a good sign because um, that will help you to double check everything uh, in your case, which will help you actually, actually just climb up this mountain that is in front of you when you step into this new adventure way faster, okay? Let's get into your cards now. Let's see what is coming my beautiful Aquarius way. All right, guys, let us see, let us see. We have, today is the 25th. We have a full moon in uh, Leo and Leo is the energy of fire action and the uh, manifestation also it's a perfect like just as I said Leo we have the sun card coming through here sun indicates that uh, there's going to be a very optimistic change really coming forward the hierophant I talked about 20 times now he came, comes through this looks perfect though this is like a very um beautiful depiction of the hierophant so uh this can be your energy as well okay it doesn't have to be initially a taurus but this can be a taurus that is actually leading and at the same time helping you so if you keep your positivity and do not back down and know that everything's always working out for your behalf on your behalf even though it doesn't seem like it uh you're gonna get a massive authority within you and also someone will maybe the taurus might come up and actually uh, give you your desire. Taurus can, uh, the hierophant also means marriage. If you're planning, if you're desiring that, we also have the Ace of Wands here. This indicates marriage as well. Back to back, two cards of the official things, celebrations, joy coming through. So if that's what you're desiring, you might get an offer. The cups were in the cup as well. There are two cups. You might get the offer around this time. And also maybe the four can be like, this is like five four came back to back and we have the 19 here number 19 with the sun card so during the time of may uh april may time you might get and 19 four five plus nine nine so during that time you might start to get the signs of the things that you're desiring if you're not looking for marriage this can be uh like a new um endeavor new thing that you're going to be walking into maybe a new job a new friendship a new environment that you're going to be feeling like married to but in a very positive way when you step in you're going to feel joyful celebrated and accepted and also like uh, the fire means that you're going to be having a lot of passion you're going to feel a lot of passion while you're doing this thing okay Right, my beautifuls, that's all for today. Hope you enjoy your reading. If you do, don't forget to give us on a thumbs up. And if you want to see more of these, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I wish you all a magical day. Bye.